The Summarize tool. If you spent any time in Alterx, you probably have already run into the need to summarize your data. Just like a pivot table in Excel, this tool lets us aggregate our data into a more concise level of detail. To get started, let's navigate to our Transform Tool category, grab the Summarize tool, and connect it to our data. Looking at our configuration, we'll see the fields from our input show up there, in the Fields section. We could select all the fields or certain data types by using the drop-down in the upper right area of the configuration window, but for the most part, you'll select one field at a time, or a few fields using the Control and Select option. For our example, we'll group by two fields that are string types and summarize one numeric field. When we have the field or fields selected that we want to summarize, we can click the Add button. Depending on our selected field's data type, we'll have different summary processes to choose from. Note that Alteryx will indicate whether or not the summary process makes sense for that selected field by graying out all the processes that won't work for that field's data type. Once added to the Actions section, we'll be able to control the order of our output by using the up and down buttons. We can also use the delete option if we no longer want that field. Just like in our select tool, we can rename a field by typing a new field name in the output field name column. You'll see that our string fields don't have any prefixes on them, while our numeric field does. While we can rename these fields one by one, we could also utilize a dynamic rename tool to control the naming conventions. Let's run our workflow and check our results. There you have it a summarized data set that we could export to Excel, maybe use to append to our original data set, or publish to another location for further analysis. This tool has use cases for almost every data type, string, numerics, spatial, and even reporting elements in Alteryx. I'll include a link to all summary processes in the notes section of this video. Thanks for watching. You can find out more about this tool's capabilities in the Alteryx tool documentation, which can be found in the description section of this video. Keep up with the latest Data Coach videos by hitting that subscribe button. And if you have an Alteryx tool or macro you want to see included in the two minute tool collection, give us a shout on Twitter at AskTessalation or tweet at me at Nick612Hayland. Until next time, your data coach and Alteryx ace, Nick Hayland.